Welcome to Glick and Print. This demo will show you how to print brochures and 3UP gift certificates. To start, click on the Brochures category. Select the blank background. Here, you will see an outline for your brochure. Use the Zoom In and Zoom Out buttons at the top of the screen to get a better view of your page. Click the Horizontal button to orient your page properly. We will start by designing the outside of our brochure. You can do this by creating text boxes and typing in your own text, or by using a brochure template. Click on the Templates and Layouts category. You will find the templates under 3UP Cards slash Brochures. Click on the Landscape template. The template will give you three text boxes for each section of your brochure. Since we are working on the outside of our brochure first, the rightmost box will symbolize the cover. Double-click in the text box and begin writing the text for your cover. Highlight any text that you wish to change. Change the alignment of your font by using the Alignment buttons on the right-hand menu. Click on the size box to increase or decrease the size of your text. To change your font, you can select fonts individually, or you can check off the Click to Hover Over Font box. This will let you mouse over different fonts and see which one works best for your text. Feel free to change the position of your text within a text box by using the Enter and Backspace keys on your keyboard. You can create a border for any text box by selecting a text box and clicking on the Shape Outline button. Here, you can choose between different border thicknesses. Change the color of the border by selecting a color from the Border Fill menu. Adjust the size and position of the text box so it fits within the guidelines of your template. Be sure to add your business's address and other relevant contact information on the cover of your brochure. You can embellish your brochure cover by adding a company logo or a decorative image. To do this, click the Add Image icon at the top of the screen. Select the image from the appropriate folder on your computer. You can freely adjust the size and position of any image like you would a text box. You can use the grid lines feature in the right hand menu if you want some extra precision aligning the contents of your brochure. In this case, the middle section on your brochure will represent the back. The leftmost section will represent the inside flap. For this example, we've left the back of our brochure blank, and we've added some information about our company on the inside flap. You can further decorate the pages of your brochure by using clip art or shapes and lines.
You can change the inside color and border color of any shape by using the color options in the right-hand menu. Change the shape outline to see various styles for your shape. Check off the Hover Over Color box to mouse over different colors and see which one works best for you. You can make copies of shapes by using the copy and paste icons at the top of the screen. When you're satisfied with this side of your brochure, click the Save icon in the top left corner of the screen. Be sure to distinguish this template as the outside for your brochure. Next, click on the Print icon in the top right corner of the screen. Click on your printer preferences. Make sure that your orientation is set to landscape and that the paper size is a standard 8.5 by 11 inch letter size. In your printer list, make sure that you have the correct printer selected. Finally, select the number of copies you need to print out. Print out your brochure covers and set these pages aside for later. Click on the new icon in the top left corner of the screen to create a new template. Be sure to select the same 8.5 by 11 brochure template that you selected earlier. Again, change your page orientation to landscape. Select the same landscape brochure template as earlier. All of these sections represent the inside of your brochure. Design them however you like. When you're ready, save your template. Again, be sure to distinguish this template as the inside for your brochure. Click on the print icon. Like with your brochure covers, make sure that the orientation is set to landscape. You will need to load the pages you printed earlier back into your printer. Select the number of copies you need, but always be sure to print out a test page first to make sure that the reverse side of your brochure printed out correctly. In this final example, we'll use the same template to create 3UP gift certificates. For this design, we'll keep the page orientation portrait. Under Templates and Layouts, select the portrait template under 3UP cards and brochures. You can design three identical gift certificates per page, or three different ones. To create three of the same gift certificates, select your design and then click Synchronize. As you can see, this will copy your design into the rest of the sections on your page. From here, you can further customize or embellish your certificates. Use clip art or shapes and lines to give your certificates a unique look. 
When you're ready, click print. For this page, you can print your page out normally using the portrait orientation. Select how many copies you'd like to print out, or customize further pages of certificates. Thanks for using Click and Print. We hope you enjoy using the program. Please contact our customer service team if there's anything you need assistance with.